with three wins from three so far, Bangkok United are aiming to extend their winning run in Group F and move closer to qualification in the process. A win here at the Tamasat Stadium would leave Bangkok United almost certain to reach the knockout stages. And on home turf, they go in as favourites against Hong Kong's Kitchi. Willen Motta and Arunrath Pumichantuk have both scored twice in the group stages, with the latter unavailable for today's game. Kitchi reached the knockouts themselves last season, but this time they sit bottom of the group, having suffered three defeats from three, albeit each one by the same 2-1 scoreline. Jakob Jantje scored in their match day three defeat to the same opposition. They'll be out to avenge that defeat today. The corner sent into the middle and the captain's there, but he steers his header just wide. The first good chance of the game goes to the home team. Anand's corner and Everton's header just off target. Mingazov cuts inside and pushes forward for Kitchi. has a go at goal. It was well wide in the end, but there was a deflection. Defender Everton got his boot on that to keep it away from goal. That's the best chance Kitchi have managed so far. Bangkok have it in the midfield. It's in to Willen. Willen turns and nobody's closing him down here. Willen has a look at goal and scores from all of 35 yards out. The shot was swerving and bouncing and the Kitchi keeper was caught out. Remarkably, it's the first time Bangkok United have scored first in this group stage. They lead 1-0 after 28 minutes. Bangkok have it with Muadarak. It's into Srinavong. He gets it towards the bottom corner, but this time the keeper, Paolo Cesar, got down to it really well. Good shot from Srinavong, but a good save too. Bangkok on course to make it four wins from four. They're leading Kitchi 1-0 at the interval. Oh, Goncalves gives the ball away and it's back with Bangkok United. Willen, he's got runners in support, Willen. Into the D, takes a shot himself. Good palms to it from goalkeeper Paolo Cesar. Both sides have had half chances since the break, but that was the first really good look at goal in the second half. Anan on the left plays the cross. There's appeals for handball. And the referee has decided that this is a penalty. Poon Pui Hin penalised for stopping the cross with his arm. Mahmoud Aid from the spot, well saved. A strong left hand from Paolo Cesar. And the keeper keeps Kitchi's hopes alive. It's still just 1-0 to Bangkok United. Kitchi have been buoyed by that penalty save. Here's Fernando on the flank. Jancha with the run into the middle. It comes to Jakob Jancha. And he fires it in as well. The Austrian brings Kitchi level with 20 minutes left to play. They've scored in every game so far, but can they use this as a springboard for some points? Kitchi play it down the right. So much more attacking football from them now. Poon goes over to it, but it's a bit of a tussle as the ball goes out of play. And he's been sent off. Poon was chasing it down. He seemed to be pulled down, but Caught the opponent with his boots and apologised immediately. The referees checked it. Kitchi are down to 10 men. Bangkok United desperate for the winner. Jaron Onkran in the area. One shy Jaron Onkran fires over the bar with the goal at his mercy on 90 minutes. What a chance that was to win it. It's a first battling point for this Kitchi team. Bangkok United will be disappointed, but they still enjoy a four-point lead at the top of Group F. 1-1, the final score.